going to look at figure 2.1 on page 27 of your textbook. This, this graph looks at the fundamental balance principle. The fundamental ba balance principle tries to show the relationship between uh, materials extracted from the environment and residuals. So the, the principle says everything that happens, happens within the environment, the natural environment. So there's nothing, ha yeah, everything is within the natural environment. We get raw material out of the natural environment and these raw materials goes to the producers. The producers uses these uh, raw materials to make goods and services, right? So let's say, just say goods over here. And these goods then ultimately go to us, the consumer. Now, the goods isn't the only thing that comes out of the production process. Another thing that comes out of the process is waste, or in this case we call it residuals. So let's call it residuals. It's just a type of waste or something that's left over after production. And there's two things that can happen to these residuals that is that comes out of production. The first is we can just discard it into the environment back again. So yeah, everything that came in, a part of it goes back to the environment as waste or as byproduct. Or we can just recycle some of it and use it again in production. We might see something like this in a glass factory, for example. They take sand out of the environment to make glass with. The producer, the glass fac uh, factory or producers, makes glassware. This glassware goes to us, the consumer. If there's sand left over or glass shards, then it's a residual. Some of it they can't use and discard it into the environment. Others they can use again and, and recycle it to use it in, in future production. So there's a certain amount of residuals you can see here in production. Then the consumer also, ha also generates residuals. So after we've used the glass, let's say it breaks in a couple of years, then we can discard it because there's then again these residuals. Now residuals we can either dis discard into the environment as waste or same as the production, we can recycle it. So if you recycle old glass jars, for example, then it goes back to the producer and they use it again. Okay, so have a look on the discussion on the fundamental balance principle. Uh, see what you know what we can make with this that the raw materials coming into this the system is equal to everything that's eventually discarded by the producer and everything that's eventually discarded by um, the consumer so everything that comes from nature eventually goes back into nature so um, in examination you won't be asked to draw this it's not necessary, but you have to be able to explain this fundamental balance principle in essay format.